Now we are telling about speed math, about massive multiply using lines and in Vedic math, finding the day of the week in less than 30 seconds from 1900 to 1990. For example, 34 and 63, the first digit is 3, so we draw 3 cross lines, give some space to the each of the number. The second digit is 4, so we draw again 4 cross lines. After the symbol of multiplication, the first digit is 6, so we draw 6 cross lines. Give some space and the second digit is 3. So we draw again 3 cross lines. We divide it into some parts. The first section, the rods are 12. So the result is 12. So the second section, the rods are 13. So the result is 33. The third section, the rods are 18. So the result is 18. In the first section, the second digit is add to the second result. The answer is 34. In the second section, second section the answer is 34. The second digit is added to the third section. So the answer is 21. The exact answer is 21,242. I am studying time class and she is my partner Vidya Akila. We will explain about the structure of heart. Heart is a, heart is a important organ in our body. Heart is situated in between the ribcage and the vertebral column. Heart is the shape, shape of roughly triangular. And it is in the size of one small piston. Heart is made up of cardiac muscles. Heart is protected by a membrane called pericardium. This pericardium is filled with a membrane called pericardial fluid. The pericardial fluid right the heart is filled with a fluid called pericardial fluid. This helps the heart from external shocks. The heart is divided into four chambers. The upper chambers are called arteries. And she is my partner, Pavani. This occasion, we are showing about the how the magnetic lines form around the bar magnet. The earth is a big magnet, sir. It affects on the bar magnet. Due to that, the lines are formed around the bar magnet. First, we take a bar magnet and place on the white sheet and sprinkle fine powder of iron filings. The iron filings, we set them as a pattern. This pattern represents the magnetic field, sir. First, we put that the Direction at the north. The compass shows the direction. We put the point where it shows the direction. And at the at the end of the point, we again put the compass. It shows direction. Such a way we draw the points, sir. So the line is formed from the north to south pole. This is called the magnetic line of force. Such a way we, we draw the more lines with the use of compass. First, we draw the north directions, north, south, west, east, sir. This is the, it shows the geometrical direction. Good afternoon, sir. My name is Madhuri. I am studying in Nandikla. She is my partner, Monica. Uh, I am telling you about Valkana. Val there are different types of Valkanas are there. Uh, Sindarkon Valkana and Valkanas. First type of Valkana are Sindarkon Valkana. Sindarkon Valkana are circular and oval, oval cone made up of a small fragment and single, single vent are there. She is my partner. Good afternoon, sir. My name is G. Ali Kastela, studying in eighth class. Today, today, 28 February, we are celebrating as a National Science Day. We are doing a project on topic is rainwater harvesting and utilization. What are the uses of the rainwater? How can we purify the rainwater? Uh, let us see. Okay. So, so what is, how can we preserve water? We are getting rain. So can we can see now here. This is the roof catchment area. We, we, this should be 0 0.8 to 0 0.9. And this, this should be made with concrete, concrete tiles and this rain water falls in it and passes to the monthly collection sum. This monthly collection sum is nothing but the monthly collection sum collects the water which is coming from the roof catchment area and it comes to the pressure and it passes to from this monthly collection sum the water passes to the 
pressure gauge. This pressure gauge is nothing but what which are the sol dissolved salts are present in the rainwater. It it, it removes and it's tracking this. And again, it it passes to the month monthly sum, monthly collection sum. This collection sum. This collection this collection sum is nothing but it pressures the water and it passes to the sand filtration. This sand filtration is nothing but which are the particles is there in the in the rainwater sand particles it removes off and it comes to the electrode filter. Carbon electrode filter. This carbon electrode filter also is nothing but this purifies total water and it purifies and it sends to the tank. This this water we can use for daily life, daily uses except drinking and cooking. We can use this water for anything. We can we can store this store this water as in tanks and we can use this tank should be 500 meters cube and we can store this water. In our future also we cannot double like that. We can we can have so many water. We can with essential water. Please secure sec, save water and secure your future. Thank you.